election 2010. Here's one of the five candidates running for mayor of Grand Prairie. Hello everyone, and the fellow members of the Chamber of Commerce, thank you for the invitation. Tax is the main issue that we deal within our life today. It is now time to create balance between our tax structure and the taxpayer. Most people are unable to pay their high taxes and bills due to insufficient income. We need to increase our resources rather than increase the taxes because then all the financial burden will affect the residents of the city people of Grand Prairie. People of Grand Prairie are not a fundraising machine. The municipality has already increased property tax by 2.8% in the last budget. Grand Prairie is already one of the most expensive cities in Canada too. If we would like to increase our taxes, we will first need to increase our resources to fill this gap through a strong lobbying to get more share from the province, create new modern business infrastructure to support business growth, create investment awareness by creating an attractive package for national and international business growth to invest in Grand Prairie, by giving more opportunity to the public to establish a small industrial zone for small investor and retired professionals. This core policy would create more jobs and greater more revenue. Basically, my goal is to convert Grand Prairie into an industrial hub. One of my priorities that I would truly highlight is a railway connecting Grand Prairie and Edmonton. A railway is an excellent way to boost our economy and a great support to thing and for faster and safer traveling easily during the long winter. N not now, but in the future, we would definitely need expressway, flyover, bridges, and more highways because of the growing population and increasing traffic. A university is a necessity for an educated and civilized society, and I would like to establish a University of Grand Prairie, which will prepare our next generation for the upcoming challenges by the provision of highly professional uh, education and program. I would also like to establish technical training center which would provide mechanical and electrical diploma program as well as first aid and safety training courses. I would also like to increase the police force and the fire department and provide upgraded and modern technology to decrease crime ratio and provide more safe and secure environment. I believe that we need to advance in supporting in the families with low income by providing them with low cost housing scheme and also in respect of seniors, I am willing to provide an improved senior house and nursing home. Providing a healthy environment to residents of Canada, residents of Cranberry is one of the, my top priority. I would also like to make advancement to the hospital that was announced earlier by the Premier. Another one of the top priority is city of mega development and maintenance project. Thank you very much. Have a good one.